Look at this! <laughs> Hello everybody, Fortnite Battle Royale has just updated with the minigun update and it's no longer out of early access apparently, which is pretty cool. So I get 20 battle stars and 1600 seasonal gold, whatever that means. What we're really here for is the minigun. There it is, new updates. And there's apparently going to be a new completely silent weapon coming soon. That's pretty cool. It still defaults to squads instead of solos because of that bug. But let's just go for it. We need to see what this minigun is capable of. And to do that, we need to get in the game and find out. Fortnite servers were down for a few hours and they just came back up. So I'm one of the first people to get into a game here. Here we go. Where's the best place to find it? Probably like Snobby Shores. So Snobby Shores has a ton of chests. I think I'll go there. <gasps> Oh, I got it! No way! Oh, oh, it takes pistol bullets. Oh, I'm so glad it takes pistol bullets. All right, guys, we got it. We got the minigun! First game, too. All right, let's check out its stats. Damage, 74. Uh, critical hit, okay, so you can't crit with it. Fire rate, 1.5, magazine size, 8. That doesn't make sense. Uh oh Oh, no. No! And now look at him! Look at him go. Well, I guess that's what it looks like. I am not warmed up at all. I'm sw I swear I'm not usually that bad. I have 22 wins. Like, I'm, I'm not I'm not a bad player, but oh, I completely potatoed that. We have to get another one. Let's do it. That guy's a minigun. Did you see him? On the bright side, I hear a fight up ahead. Oh, there's a person right here. Hello. Uh, I'm just gonna grab all your stuff real fast. Don't mind me. This guy's running into the storm to get away from me. Got him! Let's go! That's exactly what I needed. There's so much stuff! Ten mini shields! And a mi Oh, there's- Okay. Guys, so it looks like there's purple and legendary miniguns. That's cool. I did not know that. Oh, man. Oh, man, what a cleanup. That could- I could not- have asked for a better fight to run into. Use a med kit, and then we'll try out this minigun on some trees real fast, see how it goes. So we already looked at the stats for the legendary minigun. Um, the epic minigun, just 16 damage per bullet, I guess. Uh, fire rate of 12. Critical hit damage, no crits. Reload time, 4.7. Alright, so how many bullets does it, does it hold? Or... Or does it not need to be reloaded? Um... Okay, then. It doesn't need to be reloaded! Look at this! <laughs> That's amazing! This is the best gun I've ever seen! Oh, I'm so glad this is added to the game. Alright, uh, oh, the circle's so far. Alright. Um, so I was shot at. I looks looks like I'm gonna die. Yep. Feels bad, man. Oh, what does this mean? What does this I mean? Someone else was in this. I couldn't see where the bullets were coming. I couldn't see any tracers. I couldn't see any. So that's a feels bad, man. But we have to get the minigun and use it on some players and some players' bases and see what it's like. So far, we've gotten the legendary. We held it. Looked at its stats. We've held the epic. We've looked at its stats, but we have not yet fired it at a player's base and at players in general and see how it does in a fight. That's what I want to do. And hopefully not get caught out in the storm twice in one game. Oh, that was a little bit unlucky. Honestly, I used to go to Flush Factory as like my go-to, but this place is better, honestly. All right, looks like I'm first. There's one other person coming here. So I just heard some bullets go off this way. All right, there's a guy here. 66, and he's dead. All right, beautiful. Drink a mini, and drink a slurp. Gotta save my pistol bullets for you know what. For not a pistol, that's what. All right, I hear a chest. Yeah. We're not getting our favorite item, but that's okay. We'll find one. There's gotta be one here. Out of all the things I can loot here, there's gotta be one. And no minigun. By the way, get these pallets for tons of wood. Like, you'll be set. I'll get one soon. Very, very soon. All right, I'm actually good from the board of this game, which helps. Uh, what's that? Oh, there's something legendary up there. It might be a minigun. Let's go for it. Oh, it's a scar. All right, you know. 
Oh, that's pretty good to just find in the middle of the forest. Run! In case you guys don't know, the regular technique is pump shotgun, switch to scar, and then switch back to pump shotgun, if they're close anyway. If they're far away, then stick with the scar. Oh, that's a purple scar and a blue tack. Looks like someone is geared up if they left that stuff there. I'll drop my sniper if I find a minigun. Oh, wow, look at this uh, volumetric, like, fog here. It looks nice. Like these uh, graphical updates to the game. Looks it looks good. What's that over there? Is that a minigun? Can't tell. Too far away. Oh, there's a person right there. Oh, you don't know I am here. Get him! Get him! Get him! Alright. Oh, he's got a minigun! Well, now we know what it's like. Wow! Building is useless! This is very, very bad. Well, I might be dead. But either way, we got to see how a minigun can be used in a fight, and wow, it is very strong in a fight. I'm gonna try and use this med kit. Oh no. Come on, get him! Yes! Oh, get owned! Alright. Alright, I did it. I did it! Let's drop this guy. Put that guy there. Boom. Pick up this minigun. Holy. Wow. That was hard. He definitely um, wanted to get that minigun kill. So close up. Minigun, not so good. Far away, like medium range, taking out someone's base, amazing. Actually overpowered. And it's a legendary one. Let's take a look at his stats again. Why does it say 74 damage and the and like the other one says like 16? I don't get it. Might be a bug. Look at this thing, it's so huge. Right. Ah. Alright, you know what we gotta do, guys. We're going for him. We're going for it. Arrgh! Okay, uh, this might be a little bit too far for them again. All right, people are fighting over there. I have no meds. This is bad. I can try and build up and then use my minigun. That's what I'm going to have to do. Metal base time. All right, here we go. See this guy's base? How about we give it a little bit of a redecoration? I hit him. It does so little damage. I am, I'm hitting him. Oh, I'm hitting him. Oh, it feels bad, dude. He's gonna run out of all of his materials. Oh, man. The fact that it doesn't need to be reloaded is actually stupid. Maybe. Like, it's unrelenting. It is completely unrelenting. It just doesn't stop. All right, looks like he's building up here. So I have to try and build up here before he does. Oh no, I'm dead. Yep, missed my shot there. But guys, we got to see what the minigun is capable of by both getting attacked by it and using it offensively. And it is a really cool weapon. Um, I've always said that if you have a rocket launcher late game for taking care of people's bases, you have a massive advantage. But now, I think this minigun might just be better than the rocket launcher for that late game advantage. Because building late game is so important. Getting that high ground, getting that base set up. But now with the minigun, you can just destroy bases and pepper people in the process. Now, it's probably, it might be a little bit too strong. So maybe there should be a reload time and it should have like 100 bullets. And the reload time should be like 5 seconds or something. I think that might balance it a little bit because like, if you have to spam materials until they run out of pistol bullets, you're probably going to run out of materials. If it's late game anyway. It depends how many bullets they have, but still. You will drain people of their materials extremely fast. But anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this first look at the new minigun in Fortnite Battle Royale. And if you did, make sure to leave a like below and subscribe if you have not already. But of course, I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye, everybody.